what is going on guys it is your boy us you're back at it again with some more videos and today um we got some more news because it looks like i know you guys have read the title but it looks like kid boo um his his stage three event has been translated so you kind of know where this is going to go because if he's been translated and he does come out before the tech angel um goku then that means Goku's being pushed back. Now, as a marketing standpoint from Bandai, because I'm not going to be completely biased and mad or anything like that about it, I can kind of understand why they're doing it. Because let's be real here, um, so many people didn't want to summon on <laughs> on this banner up here. Yeah, so many people didn't want to summon on the Saiyans only banner, just for a simple fact that, by the way, I am on the JP side of Doku Battle or DBZSpace.com, as you can see up there. Uh, these two guys right here, the Super Saiyan 3 Tech, Angel Goku, and the Time Breaker Barda from Mass Saiyan, they do come back on other banners. And I think the reason why they gave us Super 17 was just the simple fact that uh, Vegeta, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, has not been back in the game for a very, very, very long time since the beginning of the two-year anniversary. He, he, he wasn't back yet. And Goku had already been back, you know, with the, with the Omega Shinron uh, summon, summoning banner. So I can see why they did it. But these two guys right here, they do come back on other banners. Seen as main reason why everyone was like, okay, well, I'm going to skip that Saiyans banner because, well, the um, Timebreaker Bardock or Mass Saiyan is back on the Janemba banner, which is a featured unit on this banner. But, but we all know that once this banner hits, he is a unit that you can get out of any banner after that. So technically, we should be able to go up in a Super 17 banner because this was on JP. Um, he should be in this banner. So there you go. He's literally right there in the banner. So the only other, the only banners you couldn't get him out of is obviously the other um, type banners. So anything that wasn't a tech type banner, you could you couldn't get him out of. But you can get him out of the Rising Carnival banner. You can get him out of the Kid Boo banner. Uh, I don't think you can. I don't even know if you can. Could you get him out this banner? Hell no! Nah. That's right, because it was only it was only them. Dumbass. Uh, you couldn't get him out of the uh, Gogeta banner, but you but obviously you can get him out of Janema banner because he's featured here, and yeah, like I said, he's featured in everything else, even the double rates banners and stuff, except for obviously the type banners, and yeah, he was literally featured back on the Super Saiyan three Broly banner as well. So if you notice anything of scrolling up through here, uh, you would notice that for global right now currently it went to super saiyan 4s uh it went cooler then with super 17 and then supposedly now with this um with this translation that we've got it's going to go kid boo now if you notice anything kid boo is literally before the uh gogeta and janemba banners which by the way these two guys are literally featured on both of those banners so I'm thinking uh, Bandai was like, well, seeing as everyone doesn't really want to go for these cards anyway, the thing that they could possibly do here is they may give us Kid Boo and then push this banner back before these uh, these two banners right here, these dual type banners whenever they come out. And what that is going to do for us on global is meaning that we're probably going to have to summon for these guys. And that's kind of crappy because it's like they're probably going to take out uh, the angel super saiyan 3 tech goku and probably put in maybe maybe they put in super saiyan 4 goku uh, not goku perfect uh vegeta and then maybe they put someone I, i'm trying to think of someone else they could possibly put on on this banner right maybe they um maybe they put kid boo maybe they put kid boo in in place of um uh, time breaker bardock or maybe they just leave Time Breaker Bardock there as as well, but maybe they do that. Maybe they take them guys off that off those banners. That way, it's like okay, this banner is here. Now you have to summon on the banner. So it's seen as we pushed back so close because I don't think that that global wise is probably going to literally have that banner be there and then be like, oh, by the way, you know, not even two weeks later, we're going to have a dual fest to where there's going to be a huge strike on sale and those same cars that you just summoned for. Are going to be back on these banners. I don't think they're going to do that. I think that 
as a marketing perspective from their side, they're probably going to push them all the way back until it's right until that banner is right before these two banners and then have it that way to where we have to summon on it, which still kind of sucks because when they're pushing, okay, when they're pushing this banner back, um, the free to play uh, Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, that goes super that goes to Super Saiyan 3, Doken Awakens, they're pushing him back. The Baba Shop uh, physical Goku, they go Super Saiyan 3, they're pushing him back. The um, the great, and I do mean great, Doken Awakens that you get for Bardock, so SSJ Bardox that you get from the Mass Saiyan banner, well, I guess the, the event, um, they're getting pushed back as well. So when you look at it that way, they're pushing back a lot of good cards that need to come to the game just because they're kind of like okay no one's gonna summon on um, on the banner so we might as well make it to where they have to summon and then it's pushing back all those cards so like i said that could possibly happen and we could literally possibly be wrong and it's just them preparing for that and but they're still going to give us a tech angel goku because i think uh I want to say 17's only been here for like five days or, or something like that. So, I mean, he's still got like a week and, and a couple of days before. I think Friday would be a week. So, he's literally got like another week in, in two days before, you know, he's going to go away. And then we're going to get the new banner, whether it be Tech Angel, Super Saiyan 3 Goku banner, the, the Saiyan banner, or it is the Kid Buu banner. Because if it is the Kid, the Kid Buu banner, you got to think of something. Um, a lot of people don't run this. A team at all intelligence team no one no one really runs it it's not that the kid boo is super super bad or anything like that it's just that when you, when you think about uh the super saiyan fours um they're gonna out damage like with everyone on their team they're just gonna out damage and when with counters and everything on the team as well i mean their defense and everything is just way way better and it's kind of the same thing with uh with one of the reasons why for the um Super 17 was no one kind of really want to go for. even though this banner is amazing That's the only reason why anybody summoned on it because the banner was absolutely amazing The fact you can get another Super Saiyan 4 uh, Vegeta you can also get you know Rose and you can get Super Vegito and then the two androids for Their support were, were amazing. I think that's the reason why But this banner is kind of one of those that I'm personally gonna skip because I don't necessarily need anything off that I already have Golden Frieza I don't have Buhan, but at the same time I don't really care about Buhan anymore and that's just me personally I know someone out there is probably gonna be like you know I want Buhan I'm gonna summon for this kid boo like if you are then congratulations definitely go for it if he is the next one but I think I think one thing I want to say right now before I do get out of here guys is that I did I did someone did comment and basically say that from the uh, new chapter that's gonna be coming out for global chapter four part one I think you're supposed to be able to get uh, I think they said hundred and eight dragon stones off that so you put at it that way especially if you're free to play I mean you do all that then that's that's another hundred eight that maybe if you want to go and do a multi or two on this one if you already have stones you know saved up you can do it and if not then just save all of those stones um, up until until we literally see if, if this guy is going to is going to be the next lead to come out after Super 17 or not, because if he is out before the Tech Angel Goku does come out, then what I basically just said of uh, them possibly taking these guys off those banners and replacing them with someone else and putting them literally, obviously right before uh, those banners is probably going to happen, because there's no way that they're they they're not going to pull out this Tech Angel Goku and then um have these banners come out and then you know put him out after those banners that's probably not going to happen because after like literally we see that after those banners is this guy right here so i doubt they'll do that and i doubt they're going to hold off on him like literally until until the super saiyan 3 broly and they can have like a dual fest or for both Super Saiyan 3 Angel Tech Goku and Broly, I doubt they're going to do that because that would be absolutely dumb. <laughs> because for one, even though that tech team is is still good, both tech teams are still really good. Yeah, I, I don't I don't see that happening that way. But you guys can let me know in the comment section below how you guys are really feeling if you think they're actually going to wait out and literally do what I basically said and put out the Super Saiyan. 
three tech angel Goku right before we get to the Janemba and Gogeta banner, or if they're if this is just really nothing and they're probably gonna have it come out next and then Kid Buu and then just go with that. Let me know in the comment section below how you guys feel about that. If you're new to the channel, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And I'm out, guys. Peace. Just go Super Saiyan at least to give me an SR. That, that, that way I'd be happy with that. Just give me an SR. So, you guys know how this goes. 3, 2, 1, we're all going to fire at the exact same time. So, let's get it. 3, 2, 1.